Namaste guys, in this video we are going to learn how to make this pie chart animation in Blender. So let's start. So here's our default scene. Press uh, select this default cube, press X and delete. Now go to add mesh and you can select plane. After that press 7 on your numpad. Now scale along X axis uh, as X2. Basically I have scale along X axis two times. After that, press G, X, 2. Okay. Now, R, X, 90. And move this origin point to the 3D cursor. To do that, go to object, set origin, origin to 3D cursor. Okay. Now, select this, press S, set, 0. I guess, S, Z, 0. Okay, now press 7 on your numpad. Here you can select the plane. Now go here. Now click on the screw modifier. Okay, click on Y axis. You can see it is it is in the oval shape. So to make it correct shape, select this, press Ctrl A and apply scale. Now it is correct shape. Okay, now it is not look like a circle. So increase the step view and Render. You can reduce the step view, but make sure your render view is high so that you can get the better quality result in render. Okay, step view is that view that you are currently seeing. Render view is uh, it what you get after the rendering. Uh, in industry, step view is normally less because they will be less load on a PC. But render is high because only at the render time you will get all the mesh load. Okay, so choose as per a requirement. Now, how I can do the animation? To do the animations like this, you can increase or decrease this as per your requirement. Okay, uh, let's say uh, let's move it upwards. Let's make it zero degree. Click on here. Now move to fifty seconds. Make it to seventy. Okay, and click on this time. Now select this. Press Shift D G Z. Okay, and move this to here and start at 350 and uh, to 40 and it will end at I'll make it to 40 and it will end at 360 now let's give them color so go here, new, and let's make it red, and this one select it and give it a any color you want. Let's make it yellow. Press seven on your numpad. Now if I go back and make it hundred, and Okay, select so like this one. Uh, I have to make it correct as well. So, as you can see, that it is not looking that great. So, what I can do for that? Basically, I want this part will show that onwards. So, what I can do? Select so like go here and uh, for a second, let's hide the first plane and let's just look at this one. So basically, I don't want to start here. So what I can do? One up school. I don't want to do any kind of school thing. So let's see what I can do here. Just make it 360 degree and go here make it 0 degree okay now if I go click on play I just also click on this so you can see the animations look now great now it's working fine so in that way you can make more okay you just need to add layers and you can do adjustment as per requirement now Press 0 on your numpad and press N and 
let's align the view from the top uh, click on here uh, make it 90 degree uh, basically select the camera 0 0 0 I need to move upward x y axis so it looks great and go here and increase it let's make the background blue so this is how it took like at the final now this light uh, uh, you know lighting is not looking good so add some lightning so select this one press x uh, instead of deleting it let's just modify it go to the area rectangle uh, okay and it is inclined i don't want it inclined basically zero 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 make it y zero x zero uh, let let keep it at some distance from z and 18.1 if i click on render image fully render let's see how does it look like so it looks great to me uh, so let's see the press zero and let's click let's view how does it look like yeah it looks great to me and you can also add text animation uh, for example number animation if you don't know how to do that just check out the link in description uh, you will learn from it okay so i hope you learned something from this video if you have any kind of doubt and queries feel free to ask questions okay so thanks for watching and have a great day uh, namaste